Well, let's see. There's blood. Plasma. Urine. Bone marrow. Feces. Platelets. Sputum. Spinal fluid. Lots of swabs from every orifice or body part. Who knew there were so many things in the human body that need to be tested? That's our primary purpose here at the Mary Greeley Laboratory. The lab is open 24-7 and it's made up of phlebotomists, medical laboratory technicians, and medical laboratory scientists. Last year, approximately 75,000 specimens were collected and over 500,000 tests were performed. We not only process specimens for Mary Greeley, but also for other county hospitals, Iowa State Thielen Health Center, Iowa State Veterinary Medicine, National Animal Disease Lab, Dorna Clinic, McFarland Clinic, and numerous other facilities around the area. Every specimen that is collected for Mary Greeley follows a standard process, which starts with the physician or nursing staff ordering the test. That order triggers an alert on one of many mobile rover units and sends the phlebotomist into action. From here, they visit the patient to collect the appropriate specimen. Hi, Bev. My name's Noah, I'm from the lab. Uh, just need to get some blood from you if that's okay. Each specimen is labeled with a barcode for quick and efficient processing. From there, the specimen is sent to the lab through the pneumatic tube system. Once it arrives at the lab, the specimen is processed and the results are input into EPIC and the physician or nurse is notified. The lab is made up of a few main areas, blood bank, microbiology, hematology, chemistry, and coagulation. The blood bank stores and issues packed red blood cells, platelets, plasma, and cryoprecipitate. They also perform blood typing, identify any antibodies present in the plasma of patients, and perform cross matches with the patient's plasma and donor red blood cells to ensure that the red blood cell unit is compatible for the patient. In microbiology, our role is to identify bacterial and fungal pathogens to help patients recover from infections. We test each pathogen with a group of antibiotics to find out which antibiotic will work best to combat the patient's infection. We also use molecular and immunoassays to quickly detect viruses and bacteria. The chemistry department uses automated instruments and has a testing menu of over 70 different assays. Chemistry tests are used to determine many medical conditions, including diabetes, thyroid disorders, and liver, kidney, or heart problems. In hematology, we analyze blood and other body fluids for treatment and diagnosis of blood conditions and diseases, including leukemia, lymphoma, anemia, and malaria. We also microscopically identify normal and abnormal red blood cells, white blood cells, and platelets in the blood. The coagulation department involves a hemostasis system testing for bleeding and or clotting disorders and anticoagulation therapy. In the laboratory, we look at the patient from a lot of interesting angles, and what we learn can play a significant role in their care and healing.